They're gonna pretend like he's the director of a movie. Even though there's no movies in this game. <laughs> oh my god, look at this. Uh, uh, uh. Alright! Uh -huh. Wedding scene, take one! And... Action! <laughs> the... <laughs> yes, the Mary Tani. For real. Look! Is he... Proposing. <clears throat> Tunny? <laughs> yes, Evan? The... The fake proposal to lure out the cops. Oh, just get on with it, will you? It's make-believe, remember? Uh, yes. Uh, yes, of course. I... Um... <clears throat> I... I can bear it no longer. <laughs> I care not a jot if, um, if love be forbidden. My feelings for you cannot be tamed. I must scream it from the rooftops. Yes, because they're not abnormally young to be doing this. <laughs> uh, will you... Whoa! Will you marry me? Super bright, shiny. Was that the right of the ring? A marriage proposal in broad daylight? Surely not. If Master Leander finds out, they will rot a year in jail. Oh, everybody's looking. <laughs> oh my god. Focus, Tani! Time for your close up! Take the ring! Big ring and Well, Evan, you know what comes next. Spit it out. Uh oh. Uh, uh I love you. <laughs> what was that, man? Project uh -huh. boy, project! You are not in a cupboard, you are on the stage! Now, pucker up, my boy. Time to go in for the kill. This is underage, uh, underage direction of sexual activities. I'm reporting this guy for pedophilia. It's over. Oh, no, you don't, lad. That's my daughter. Curse she. Uh. You there, you two. You are under arrest for the crime of public affection. <laughs> About time. There's no use denying it. Her Majesty witnessed the entire sorry affair. Come with me. Well, now they're gonna get arrested. What? Nah. Uh, Whoa, oh, bang in. Jail indeed, which means a little plane went off without a hitch. Um, hey, that be so, where's the Leander swab then? Well. What business do you have here with the Archon? What exactly was your intent in flouting the laws of Hydropolis so flagrantly, I wonder? Excuse me? Are you Leander? Hmm. I am. Yes, we finally got to meet him. My apologies, we were forced to use a little artifice to gain your attention. Mm hmm? Is that so? Why would you go to such lengths? Who are you? I'm Evan Pettywhisker Tildrum, King of Evermore. I've come to ask you to sign a treaty. Excuse me. Oh my god, that was disgusting. If you speak of a union, I'm afraid I must refuse. Just like that? Well. If it were up to me, yes, but Her Majesty has ordered that you be brought before her. Huh? Queen Nerea wants to meet us? Yes. She does, although why she would wish to do so is beyond me. Hmm. All right. Now. There's no need to go into tiresome explanations. All has been shown to me. You wish, to, you wish me to sign this treaty of yours, correct? If I may be so bold. We cannot, Your Majesty. To enter into a union would be, I must advise against it. Hmm. Silence, Leander. Uh. Yes, Your Majesty. I have but one condition. 
Of course, what might it be? Wool. I need to see now far from here is a labyrinth. Deep within it dwells a great sea monster, Katis. Defeat the creature and return here unharmed. Do so and I will sign your treaty. Wow. <laughs> Buh. Really? Yes. Really, Leander will accompany you. Wow. Of course. I, of course, Your Majesty. Your Majesty's word is law. I will accompany you to the labyrinth as she wishes. We will see that the beast is destroyed. Forgive me. You must forgive me. I will not. I will not properly introduce myself. I am Leander Artis Artis Aristi Aristi. His name is Arist Aristides. Leander Aristides, Archon of Hydropolis. Mm. Good Lord. It's very nice to meet you, Archon Leander. Where exactly is the labyrinth? It lies at the sea southeast of Hydropolis. Arr! And we best be on our way. Let's sit still and give this sea taste a drubbing, shall we, me hearties? I can give him all the good stuff. Hmm. I don't know what to give him. I don't know what he's good at. Oh man, we had a great thing. We had the shiny baby buckler this whole time. I never equipped it. Son of a bitch. There we go. Shiny baby buckler. Alright, we're off. Where are we going here? Hey there. Would you like to use the Hydro Portal to travel to Cardia Square? Yes. Doing the labyrinth that thing to the left. I right, was just fast travel to the entrance here. There we go. No, it's turning to the east. Oh, that's where we were with the dead with the dead people, the ghosts. All right, that'll be cool fighting ghost people or whatever. That should be pretty interesting. Sit over there. Three items lined up. A sway weed. Boba Feet, just did a 200 bit cheer. It's good to see you back, Phil. Always good to see you. Right, uh, get right back up when you get sent back. Thank you very much for that. Boba Feats, I appreciate that very encouraging message. And of course, your support with that cheers. Thank you. Now wait a minute, where'd all the ghosts go? All the ghosts are gone now. What the hell? This is where Sedis lives. The heart of the labyrinth is guarded by a great number of spirit troops. We're gonna make our way there, it must be with an army. Alright, let's fight some of these guys. Unlock the fast travel. Well, let's get to some fights. Oh no! Well. <laughs> so, what do they have? They have blue and green and generic. So, I believe green. Green hurts blue. No, 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 no. Blue hurts red. Red hurts green. Green hurts blue. 
So I need to be sure to have a green green guys on my party and green and red. I need green and red. So green and red, I should get rid of blue. The precocious geniuses are level 10. If I'm gonna have a sniper, it should be the highest level one. So we got level 10 Sisters of No Mercy, right? All right. Blue is the biggest one, so I need another group of green. I got one more, the Silver Fox is level seven green. So this should be good, this should work good. I think so. Okay. This should be good. Bambino says, I'll have time to finish this mission tonight. The next one took him two and a half hours. Holy shit. Alright, here we go. 